Hello everyone and welcome back to another 13 Nights of Halloween. I'm here with Toast once again, this time with a different game since Monster House crashed on us. <laughs> We're here it with... This wasn't meant to be. Was not meant to be. We're here with the amazing opening. Show it. We saw this opening and I said we need to restart because people <laughs> need to see this opening. I love DMC1. Devil. I... May. I like it more than four, honestly, which I don't think is a popular opinion. Let's rock. Really? I thought four has been universally not liked. I feel like four is a love it or hate it type game, and it's like I like Nero. I think he's fine. One moment. I, I just. I... Uh, all right. Sorry about that. <laughs> Recording with me can be an adventure in its own. So let's play some Devil May Cry. <laughs> I played Devil May Cry on the HD remake. I never played it when it was a game. I think I remember playing Devil May Cry 1 and thinking this Two is actively a terrible ago, game. There was a war between you know, I feel hurt by that. <laughs> so I'm, this is going into it, and now you it is... absolutely love this game. I wouldn't say absolutely love it. It is a clunky game. Its gameplay leaves a lot to be desired. But, this but I still, I, I really like DMC one. He quietly reigned. Look at the sick jump kick. And continue to preserve yeah, by the that's demon. your boy Sparta. It's me. That is the legend. legendary Dark Knight. The legendary While you were playing Dark video Knight. games, I studied the blade. <laughs> <laughs> But I am also open to giving games a second shot, so I'm willing to try I'm this again. I'm clearly not. I never went back to Monster House. <laughs> <laughs> we learned later on that you could beat that game, I think, in under four hours. <laughs> so yeah. if, it did, if it did not crash, I would have beaten the entire game. But yeah, Don't I mean, the MC1, like I said, it, it, it's cry. funky. But I, I really Sorry, enjoy it. I mean, it's definitely not my favorite. That's yeah, gonna always be three. I can't seem to get any real business. That's five would be like... my favorite, but you have to play as V, and I don't like playing Whoa, as V. Slow down, babe. Yeah. But to be fair, it's also what everyone's been waiting for. Well, well, what do we have here? for realsies? Nature calls. It's in the back. We're missing all the sweet Dante because I don't think there was any subtitles so, on the PS2. You must be the handyman <laughs> who'll take any dirty job. Am I correct? What is that Almost. dress? Trina's dress is a little... That's great. Jobs, Perfect. You know I mean. <laughs> Aww, the best Aww. jersey put stars on it. You're the man who lost a mother and a brother to evil 20 years ago. Oh man, that poor bear in the, the background. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> it's probably a demon. Well, the way I demon bear. It, in this business, a lot of you are kind of... I, I know this is the PS2, so I shouldn't make fun of it, but the fucking neckline of Dante is extreme. <laughs> yeah. Sort of makes well, I don't know if this was Capcom first. Yeah, yeah it was. Because, again, if people don't know, this originally started as Resident Evil 4. Kamiya was like, yeah. oh, I think it was Kamiya, right? He said, let's make Resident Evil 4 something yeah. crazy. And then they said, this doesn't feel like Resident Evil, so they made Devil May Cry. Jesus, I had so much fun. Is she just gonna throw that fucking her bike at it? <laughs> yeah. Bro, my bike. Even as a child, I had powers. There's demonic blood. You gotta oh yeah, uh, get used to Dante yes. getting stabbed. <laughs> He seems to know something. Know about my He's like Looks an 80s like, wrestler. Uh, He's like, I don't believe in selling the sword. It, you, Dante has to get stabbed for it by like one of his zones for it to be a DMC game. I'm not your enemy. Which is why 2 is my not a DMC is game. Yeah, besides the fact that he's super serious. And, he's like, an and I don't world. think the reboot... He, I don't know if he gets stabbed in the reboot. I haven't touched it. Probably never will. I don't think he gets I stabbed played 1 through reboot. 5. I think I'll be fine. I played the reboot. It was actually pretty good. It's not. I've heard what, it's, it's, I've heard it's what, good. Uh, it's just not Devil for May Devil May Cry. Cry. Yeah, that's the problem. The the is yeah. that I'm also not one of those people who's like. Like oh, I've this heard is Definitive hard. Edition isn't bad to play. Yes. His it's just powers were bad Devil May Cry. He's attempting to like, it, there's no the denying world. the fucking like burned ground that they made to make that game. 
the Money. fucking that dude who came out and said like whatever fuck you guys oh this is gonna be the true devil mccray devil mccray has no fans like all the terrible things he said is like you dude you're not helping <laughs> Here he is. I've, I've played way too much cliff. Devil May Cry on, earlier this go. year. Devil May Cry. I 100%ed the HD collection, which has 1 through 3, and Jesus. I 100%ed 5, which, uh, fuck that, by the way. Okay, I'll say right now. 5, you have to S. <laughs> oh, go ahead. I'll say right now, this doesn't feel that bad. Yeah. Maybe in my mind, I was just, like, not ready for this. Maybe yeah, it's because of Monster. Five, you have to, uh. You gotta S rank every single mission on every single difficulty. Hello, yellow. Yeah, boy, did it as Virgil. Let me see if I can, uh. And then it didn't count, but I did it anyway. No, it doesn't look like there's an option for subtitles. I don't jump. think there is. Triangle is jump. So, yeah, this is the part where you can tell it was based off of Resident Evil is that there's no camera control. And every time I switch locations, the camera changes. You can also tell by a lot of like when you when you interact with items, you kind of get that like internal thought about it, like you would in Resident Evil. Hmm. First is the bloody puppets. Also, this just kind of gives me ancient vibes. I would think I like I said I haven't played Classic Ari since the last video. I've watched people play Classic Ari, but I definitely felt the same vibes. I think there are some vibes here. Red orb. There are definitely some vibes. Classic red orbs. Every orb has a face on it. It's great. This jump is amazing. He <laughs> just does a full on, like, somersault in the air. Whoop! Oh shit. Can I double jump? Yes, I can. Is you there can a jump run button? Walls. I don't think so. This is before games had a run button. It's not like he goes super slow. No, he doesn't. He goes at exactly the right speed. It's just one of those things like most modern games have run buttons. Uh, just because it's something you do. I think circle is the interact button. I accidentally okay. overjumped my shot, so I'm going to go back. You might be able to wall jump up to that top area. Over back there. Let's see. Whoop. There we go. Whoop. I can't even use any of my weapons right now. Oh, I honestly, know. like, it's... I, I honestly really like the, like, default theme for this area. The kind of, like... Hmm. Like, you, you get a bit of, like, classical in the background and whatnot. Hmm. That's pretty alright. Like, very... sure, yeah, I'm pretty sure you just heard it. Yes, I did hear it. It is very fitting. I I love DMC1 for like the feel like of the surroundings and the setting. Uh, voice acting Whoa. was something. Yeah, sometimes you just do a jump like that. Uh, voice <laughs> acting sure was something. Uh, it controls okay. So Toast, where do I go from here? You're asking the wrong guy. What do you mean I'm asking uh, the wrong guy? You 100 percent this. <laughs> Yeah, I sure did. Stupid giant fist. Try interacting with it, one of the doors. The door is this is 100% Resident Evil. That's RE vibe. Yep, that's yep. classic Resident Evil. Yep, that's this is in Resident Evil 4. So it, <laughs> it's in Resident Evil. You would Evil hope 5. it feels like a Resident Evil game. You would hope. I so. I mean, it has its own identity, but I think it's what gives the MC one its charm. Yeah. But at least in this early one, this is where you can tell, like, this was supposed to be based off of that. Alright. I, I, I like to say, I mean, I'm probably not giving off the greatest first impression here. If anyone wants to try DMC, I hi highly recommend starting with either 3 or 5. 5 goes on sale quite often, and obviously it's got the more recent definitive edition. 5 was special fun edition. when I played it. Five is really fun. I re highly recommend the special edition because Virgil, fucking love Virgil. And there's also um, 
what is the thing I'm trying to find the word for? The special edition, which has uh, yeah. the cutscenes re they show you the raw reel where they were real people. Yeah, the mocap. Yeah, the mocap for it. I think you can see that in the normal. I think it was like a DLC or something, but it's definitely in the special edition. Why is this man talking? Those who desire to acquire the ancient ways of war shall offer the blood of monsters in exchange. It's not responding. I'd better unseal the door beneath here at first. I think you need to interact with the door below you. It'll cost red orbs. I need 45 red orbs to open it. Do I have red orbs? Uh, you definitely have some. I don't know how much. 41. <laughs> God damn it. Damn. Did you, did, did you like that? Huh? So so can you understand why play starting this game I maybe fell off of <laughs> Devil May Cry when it started yeah, this way? Yeah, I can see it. There is a reason I recommend starting with 3 or 5. 5 is really easy to pick up and a nice thing about 5 is that there is like a special video you can play it that will like explain one through four. At least I don't have to go. So around. you, I think you just need to jump down, try and yeah, through the wall. You've got exactly enough, but yeah, it, it'll tell you like the path. It's not like there's a massive, massive plot to DMC five or to DMC in general. But it will. The explain five will to explain you. to you what you missed. It's a good pickup for beginners. I also say three to this the first, canonically. It's not like uh, Yakuza when they say, like, would you like to hear a recap of the previous game so you know what happens and it turns into, like, a 40 minute long cutscene? <laughs> Explain to you, Pre okay. Previously in Yakuza 0. <laughs> <laughs> previously in all these other games. Um, here you fucked up. The Dojima clan fucking is at it again. The I found a fucking Yakuza meme I gotta send to you now. I, f I, f I found this earlier today on Reddit. There you go, you can start in the video if you want. Alright, let me quickly pause. Here it is. Here's the photo. Everyone can see. <laughs> and now we can return to the game. I think I've beaten DMC2 a total of five times. DMC2? It's Yes, As it is five characters? more times. So the the way DMC two works is so you start off with Dante, right? Yeah. You beat normal with Dante. You unlock normal for the other character. I forgot her name because she doesn't show up ever again. That game is unimportant. I don't care. Uh, you beat normal with her, and it's like, okay, try hard mode. You have to beat hard with both of them to unlock the must-die difficulty, and you only have to beat a must-die difficulty once to get the only, the only achievement for it. Uh -huh. So I've beaten that game five times. Did you know on the PS2 version of the game it came with two discs? No, I did not. It was a two-disc game. Because uh, they said that because it required, because it had another character, it will require you, you gotta, to have... You get a jump up there? I think so, right? There you go. <laughs> Let me tell you again, the camera angle is not amazing for what I need to do. <laughs> There's a reason you're not fucking backflipping in <laughs> Resident Evil games. So, one thing I can say, uh, DMC1's combat is not the most impressive. It's, it, it works. Uh, 2 is somehow worse. Oh yeah, that's and because they... Enough, they, uh, they rushed the MC2. Not only did they but, rush but, it, um, they made the, the combat easier. Yeah, yeah sure. uh, I that beat a run of the MC2 using exclusively guns. I'm not kidding. So yeah, the, there's a series called What Happened, and they did one on yeah, the MC2. Yeah, I've seen that video. Yeah, they said- it, it's, it's a good watch if you like the MC at all. Yeah, it's also just very interesting because it's like, yeah, DMC2 is like the weird child of DM, like no one. Like uh, I don't, I don't even think they had talked to Kami or anything 
about making DMC2. I think it was in. I think it started development before DMC1 even shipped, if I recall correctly. Yeah, this game kind of accidentally became popular. Did yeah, not expect I'm, it. It is shocking DMC2 did not kill it. Apparently, yeah. people liked it from what I remember. Like, well, back the, in the day, it got decent reviews. Again, during that time, it really was less about hard gameplay and it was more about um, a story. So it was like, oh, they yeah. made this game part of this much easier, so I like it more. How do I shoot yeah. with my gun? Uh, it should be square. Really? Because okay. it's not. Okay, you might have to it. lock on? I think you may have to lock on and do square, because square, I feel like it's always been the shoot button. And there are three like openings in to insert something. Nope. Definitely the uh, Resident Evil. <laughs> yep. Here's a ladder, but the lid is closed. I can't go through. Okay. I'm going to have to go back and fight that puppet guy, aren't I? I don't know. Probably. Bitch. Try holding R1 and locking on. Yeah, there you go. Alright, there we go. Yeah, yeah, you have always beat DMC2 using nothing but guns. It was sad. Yeah, you have... I think I did it under like two or three hours. The guns are apparently very overpowered. <laughs> they are! Oh, they are. They juggle enemies. I do like the constant just choo 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 choo. I appreciate What's that really funny, no what I was gonna say earlier, so DMC 1's combat, like I said, not the best, not the worst. Uh, DMC 2 somehow made it worse. What is really odd and kind of funny and sad at the same time, uh, you can play as Trish from the opening, like you saw in the opening of this game. Yes, yeah, of course. You can play as Trish in DMC2, and she plays exactly like DMC1 Dante. So they have like the old combat style with like the timed inputs and everything. Which I, th I, I also think the whole timed input system is just really fun. To explain pretty much, it sound, it's, a, it's pretty much what you think it sounds like. If mm -hmm. you happen to like, like if you just hit like triangle, 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 like quickly, you'll do a basic combo. If you say delay the third hit, you will get like a different end to your combo. And you can do that for a lot of weapons in a lot of instances. In three? Oh no, in here. Yeah. They don't explain anything to you, but. The delayed input, like, you know, combat, is one of my favorite things in DMC, for sure. Oh. Uh, that That is not in DMC 2. This is gonna be me shitting on DMC 2. That's, that's this video. That's I'm fine. upset. <laughs> like DMC 1 is a really fun game to me. Yeah, that was interesting, because I was trying to figure, like, what do they want me to do? How am I not getting better than just C? But that's also because I'm just mashing on the button. Yeah, if you uh, use a certain like combo too many times, it stops gaining style points. You have to switch it up, switch weapons. Which as, right now you don't have multiple weapons, but you get there. I can't climb this ladder, really. Okay. This is a sane game. You have to uh, hit that multiple times. This one? Like, just keeps, yeah, keep slashing at it. Okay. Easier said than done. Also remember, at some point, there is a time limit on something. Alright, let's see if I can figure out. Oh wait, so it even changes when you hold the R button? Yeah, if you lock on and say like hold down, you will get a different result. It does a lot for just using like one attack. Ah, uh, goddammit. 
So is there something with like L2? I don't remember L2 being used for anything. I could taunt dudes. Yeah. I remember oh, there's a time there's a timer on this area and at least Dante was die mode. Oh god. Is there a way to evade? There is a way to evade. Okay. And I died. Oh, I didn't die. Not yet. There I go. Yep. <laughs> is that gonna start me all the way at the beginning? I don't know where it's gonna start you. Oh yeah, yellow wharves. They force you to use them here. Uh, later on, you get the choice to use them. I think outside of DMC1, I have never used one. Because they are a sign of weakness. Mm. I okay. I'm that, that sounded wrong. Uh, you can use yellow orbs. It's not a problem. Oh, I'm gonna use. I just. Own. I just. Did. Well, I'm I, in later games. You the choice too. And I like I was saying. I choose not to. Uh, you can. There's nothing wrong with it. Is there a uh, difference between holding the lock on and not doing it? Like you know uh, what I mean. Like, yeah, like, I, I know locking on at least lets you use uh, your gun. Other than that, I don't recall. Easier to evade, too. Let's shoot this man dead. Come on! <laughs> this camera is something else. I'm able to do that combo so far. Can I delay? Do I get more combos later? Uh, I don't think you get more. You don't get more combos, but you'll get different weapons. You mean you can switch between them? Yeah. Well, so. Weird thing is, uh. I guess it's it's kind of your two main weapons. Once you get like your technically third weapon, you get to there is a way to quick swap between that and like your main sword. This the one you have now is pretty much useless after you get your next sword. Wait, is there no reason for me to come here other than to fight some puppets? I feel like I can unlock some. Oh god. Oh yeah, check that shit out. I got an A. And I lost it. And it, it left as quickly as it came. Getting an S rank in this game would be tough. It feels like it. Let's I will also game. say one of my one of my favorite things that tends to well it sticks through like one through four I don't remember being able to do it as much in five because five is more linear and you know mission focused yeah I and while DMC one through four have missions you can typically like go back you, you well I mean the game not takes place in this mansion pretty much you revisit areas a lot. But you are never usually like hard locked from going back to an area. What? So like you could be on like the last mission and you could come back here if you felt like it. Just to get like collectibles and whatnot. That's cool. I love it. We will pause for now, we will continue on in the next part. Say goodbye, Toast. Oh, goodbye.